morning, happy June, and welcome to the 21 days of yoga. I'm going to keep this video really brief. Your first week, and the suggestion is to practice 10 rounds of sun salutations, a Surya Namaskar A from Ashtanga Yoga. So I'm going to take you through the uh, sequence slowly and then gradually build up to the pace that we would probably use during 108 rounds on the 21st or on the solstice this year. So, you'll begin by standing at the top edge of your mat. I recommend trying to settle into your ujjayi breath, the breath that comes in and out through the tip of the nose, through the back of the throat. We want to find an equal inhalation and equal exhalation. Bring the palms together to press at the center of the heart. And let's begin. As you inhale, reach your arms all the way up, let your head drop back, press your palms together. As you exhale, forward fold, bend at your hips and your knees. Bring your hands to the floor. As you inhale, extend the spine. Fingers can stay on the floor or slide up the shins. As you exhale, step back to a plank and lower down, either through knees or on your toes, all the way down to the floor for the first round. Inhale, extend your spine and bring your chest and heart forward. Exhale, curl the toes, lift the knees, and take your hips high to downward facing dog. Now traditionally, in Ashtanga Yoga, we hold the downward facing dog position for five full breaths. We're going to just practice that for the first two rounds in this video. And then we're going to remove the held posture to keep our body and our breath, our energy moving. In preparation, again, for 108 sun salutations to come. Stay here for one more full round of breath. Empty that breath completely. Bend the knees, lift the heels, and step the feet ahead towards the front of the mat. As you inhale, again, extend the spine, hands down around shins, exhale and fold. Inhale, rise all the way up, reach the palms to press, and exhale, hands by your side, samasthiti. Let's count the movements. Inhale, arms up, one. Exhale, forward fold, two. Inhale, chest forward, three. Exhale, step back and lower, four. Inhale, extending our spine, five. Hips press back and up, six. We stay here for this second round for five breaths. Here in downward facing dog, you wanna feel that the hands are pushing forward, the sides of the waist are lengthening, and the tailbone is sloping up towards the ceiling. Keeping a soft bend in the knees will help you to keep your spine long and put a little bit more focus on spine instead of the hamstrings or the back of the legs. Stay here for one more full round of breath. Empty it completely. Lifting the heels, bending the knees, look forward, and then step or lightly hop your feet between your hands. As you inhale, extend the spine. That's seven. And as you exhale, fold over your shins. That's eight. Inhale, root to rise, all the way up. That's nine. Exhale, samasthiti. Nine movements, nine vinyasas, nine parts of the breath. Let's try. Ekam, inhale, arms up. Ndue, exhale, forward fold. Trini, inhale, head up. Chatwari, exhale, step or jump back lower. Pancha, inhale, perhaps moving to upward facing dog. Shat, exhale, press back. One full breath here this round. Empty that breath completely. Bend the knees with the heels, step or lightly hop, feet to hands. Sapta, inhale, extend the spine. Ashto, exhale, forward fold. Nava, inhale, rising all the way back up. Exhale, samasthiti. Now we'll take the rhythm that we'll use for 108. Let's move with the breath. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, 
inhale, exhale. Bend the knees, lift the heels, jump. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more time together. That was five rounds. So you might like to repeat this video one more time so you can complete 10 rounds or just continue with that same uh, rhythm of moving with your own breath. Taking breaks or rest whenever you need to and we're gradually going to build upon this practice. The sun salutation sequence is a practice in its own right but you might like to do this before as a warm-up for your other practices or maybe your other exercise. Either way, you're practicing 21 days of yoga, so well done.